So, ladies and gentlemen, this contest is a special catchway challenge match of six three-minute rounds. Just the one fall, one submission, or the knockout will decide the winner. Introducing to you, firstly on my right, currently standing in the red corner, one of television wrestling's all-time colourful stars, of course, Bobby Barnes. And ladies and gentlemen, from the opposite side of the ring, one of the youngest but really sparkling stars of the future, Liverpool's own, Rob Brookside. And once again, your referee, Mr. Billy Finley. Billy Finley, the referee, takes over in this part. There he is from Rill. Originally Belfast, I understand, but now based in Rill. There on the right, the young Robbie Brookside. Tremendous future this boy's got. Bobby Barnes, as usual, taking a long time to fold that beautiful guard of his. It seems to be better than ever. It's certainly bigger than anyone I've seen before. And his wife makes them, believe it or not. Referee Finley, let's quick check over. Remember, this six three-minute rounds here. One fall decides the bout. And fairly easily distinguishable, I think, as we go for round one. Seconds away, first round. Bobby has always worn those highly coloured gear. This time it's uh, multi coloured trunks with the light blue rustling glass with a flash across the floor. Now it's experience versus youth and enthusiasm here. Barnes, who was a turned pro in the 70s. Brookside, who turned pro in 83. So there's uh, several years' experience on Bobby Barnes' side here. Bobby, a great solo wrestler, but I think everybody remembers him from the days of the Hells Angels with Adrian Streets. Adrian Street still rustling, but mostly in America, you understand? There's experience for you, the taking the arm lever, still crawl to the opposite foot, very neat. First fall is the one that matters here, remember? Just one fall decides the ball. Attacking with the toe of the sole of the foot at the instep. Billy Finley reminding him. Clench fist right in the left eye there. A minute to go in this first round of six. Nine. Big guy for the Bobby Brookside, this young boy from Liverpool, who's already travelled quite a bit in Europe. In Scandinavia. Time from Germany. Quite recently, too. Bobby Brookside got his uh, couple of years amateur experience at Graham's Fitness Gym in Kirkby, Liverpool. Trained by Carl McGrath in Kirkby. Ten seconds. Barnes going a little bit after the bell here. I don't think Finley will stand for it.
Hardly disheveled though, the hair's still in perfect order, which keeps him happy. Great to see Bobby back. It's a man who's traveled all over the world, of course. Seconds away, around two. The most difficult bout he ever had, he tells me, was uh, Sammy Lee, that great boy from Japan who was over here a few years ago. I wish he'd come back again because he was terrific. No doubt we'll see him again one day. Round two, five to go. Bobby Brookside, incidentally, is a, a DJ, a disc jockey to the uninitiated on the local independent radio station sometimes. Nicely, nicely. And taking him beautifully over the top for a folding press attempt, but it doesn't work. <coughs> and the knee came over as his man was still under it. That's uh, shin dropping over the throat. Finish. Round specialties. And the lean back now taking the neck with it. And it's the bridge formed by the young lad Brookside who might just might just save him. He's got the bridge on right. If he submits from this, it's all over. Barnes quite happy to lean back and lay it on, of course. Perfectly legitimate hold. Head scissors with a difference. Double arm stretch. And he's up. Side headlock. Caught him nicely. Four arm off attack there by Brookside. <laughs> Barnes not happy about that. Want it, that's what you'll get for it. Perfectly legitimate forearm to the stomach. Less than a minute to go. Good side out over the top rope, but intentionally because he was trying not to come back off the ropes into his opponent. I saw Bobby Barnes waiting there. Bobby Barnes receives his first public warning. Uh, first public warning to Barnes for stopping and getting in. And Brookside over the top of the flying tackle, a beautiful high one. Can he hold? No, off at two. Much hold with the back hammer on two, and a back drop as well out of the knee. Knee drop, very tricky three and one hold there. Almost on the bell of round two. Producing all his tricks here this afternoon, isn't it? Bobby Brookside is taking a lawful lot in this bout. Very nearly got a cross press just now, though. Seconds away, around three. Round three, four rounds to go. And of course, no score because this is a one four contest. Four arms smash, close in, four arms smash, perfectly legal, as long as it's not on the ropes. It's like trying to turn it around and oh, Barnes halfway up the auditorium there. <laughs> Especially after all the inside moves that Barnes has been producing. Nice drop cut. That's a good, distant drop kick there. Lean back. And another one. Barnes waiting for it, sidestepped, and a bad landing by Brookside. Close in jab, but still the forearm that's operating there. Probably won't give him up. 
Leslie. Flying tackle, beauty. Now can he hold the first press this time? He's hooked the leg, and he's got him. He's beaten the experienced man in just one minute, 25 seconds of the third round. Well, how about that? That will put a feather in his cap. Wonderful effort by young Rob Brookside. Ladies and gentlemen, only one four required. Hold on. That's two full contests, not a one four contest. This is for two calls. A two full contest. Barnes, you signed the contract. Brookside signed the contract. The referee witnessed a one full contest. Yeah. The winner of the match is Rob Brookside. Yes. This is how it all happened, this one fall. Dodge that move, a beautiful flying tackle, and Bobby Barnes couldn't get out of that because of the hooked leg there. Bobby Barnes still not happy because uh, he was swears he thought it was a two-fall contest, but he must know it was a one. Everybody else did. Anyway, that about wraps it up for this week. But next Saturday, triple tag action tops the bill. And what is more, it's continental star right, Sinbin's Annal. Meantime, bye from all of us here at Dewsbury. Have a good week.